All right, we're checking in our buddy Mike here. See how he's doing with his uh, radio. Yeah, yeah. What's going on, buddy? Why? Let me switch sides. Cause I got the light in my face here, and it doesn't come up. Yeah, that's a, that's a lot better. All right. All right. I'm um, thinking. Of, always thinking of the tubers. That's right. That's right. Well, today I'm going to be working on the uh, the main bearings uh, for the crankshaft. Got two ball bearings that we're going to be using. So, and they're a little undersized for the crankshaft. But I'll have to polish the crankshaft down, and they'll fit on there perfectly. Um, but what I've got to do is make um, uh, bearing carriers that are going to be welded onto these plates. And we have this slab of steel here, it's 3 inch uh, OD. So I'm going to cut two, uh, two wafers out of it, put it in the lathe, and uh, turn, the, turn a hole with an ID just slightly under the OD of this bearing. So it's a press fit press in fit. there. Yeah. And then that'll get welded to the plate in the center. Right. Now the the only thing I'm kind of worried about is if once I turn that and I weld it, it's going to distort that uh, that ID quite a bit. I I think mm -hmm. so. I might have to put this whole thing back in the lathe after I weld it and and true it up again to fit the bearing. Because we've, we've what we've done in the past with the past couple engines we've made is we've welded the race of the bearing right to the right to the, the plate, and that works pretty well. You just have to be be well, careful. for the, the little engines, you know, I mean, we could throw them out, we, we mess the block up, you don't, all the yeah. work you got in this, you don't yeah. want to do that. Yeah, um, you know, like, well, yeah, it's, a, it's, a, it's a more than just a, a square piece of plate. It's right. just, you know, made made to pretty tight dimensions there. So, um, that's what I'm working on right now. So I'm going to go ahead and cut the two pieces out of that. All right, go ahead, buddy. Quite a hunk of steel he's got there. Three inches. Yeah, yeah. Every, everything I've been cutting with has been pretty good. Yeah. Hmm. I'll come back when it's done. You can't rush it, Joe. What's going on, Mike? I was working on boring the hole out for the bearing. Let's see if I got the tight quarters over here. All we got right. the car in there. All right. That's for the bearing, huh? Yep. Yeah, it's got a long way to go yet. Huh. 10,000 for the time. Yeah. So. Sneak up on it, buddy. Yep. Yep. You don't want to overdo it. It's got to be a little undersized, actually, because once I weld it in, I'll put it in the lathe again and then screw it up. So yeah. it's going to be a little undersized. Yeah, and then, you, well, I was going to say ream, but we don't have no ream that big. Nah. No, and you won't be able to put a ream there anyway, because you, you won't be able to pass all the way through, because the right. end plate will be there. Alright, keep going, buddy. Alright. Alright, I think Mike's just about done over here. He's not done with the part, but I think he's uh, like I say, it's done with the work. What are you doing over here, buddy? I'm going to take this uh, plate off here. And uh, before I go today, just think about real quick uh, what I want to do for the camshaft bearings so we can get those. We can order them this week so that by, by next engine night we can have them in so I can work right. on them also. You know, I don't know if I'm going to go with bronze or I was thinking ball bearings, just doing them uh, small versions of the of the, uh, the crank bearings, mm -hmm. the same same concept but with the cam, which I think will be the which I think will be the ticket. Because if we get if we get uh, sealed ball bearings, cool. that that'll actually act as the crank case yeah, seal know, also, so I don't have to worry about that. that. Right, that'd be nice. And 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 we're doing the, you know, and, and if you know, they so pass through, it'll be even better, uh, easier to assemble. So yeah, rather yeah, than just having a bushing on the inside, so I'm just gonna take the plate off and get some ideas before the end of the night. All right, that's cool. Yeah, Mike's got to go. He's got to get up. Uh, what four o'clock tomorrow, Mike? Four a.m. Three thirty. So uh, you know. By the time he's an hour away from me, so by the time he gets home, he's ready to take a shower and hit the sack. So, all right, enough of this.